Hi guys. Welcome to a new Let's Play that I'm doing. The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. So, I've already played the GameCube version of Twilight Princess on my channel, but uh, no, it's a little bad in my opinion. Well, at least I wasn't able to directly capture the game. Um, I did it with a camera, so that's it was an old series so I think it needs to be redone what better way to do that then with the, um, the Twilight the HD version the remake well it's not really a remake it's like I said it's more like a remaster it's an HD version so all right hopefully this will continue to work for us I'll let the intro play out Excited to be playing this game again. Okay. All right. Good enough. Let's get this started. Link and Epona. Yes. So we'll keep their original names, and we're gonna go with normal mode, not hero mode. Tell me, I never feel a strange sadness as dusk falls. So it's the only time when our world intersects with theirs. The only time we can feel the lingering regrets of spirits who have left our world. That is why loneliness always pervades the hour of twilight. Enough talk of sadness. I have a favor to ask of you, Link. Supposed to deliver something to the royal family of Hyrule the day after tomorrow. Yes, it was a task set to me by the mayor, but would you go in my stead? You have never been to Hyrule, right? In the kingdom of Hyrule, there is a great castle, and around it is Castle Town, a community far bigger than our little village, and far bigger than Hyrule is. The rest of the world the gods created. You should look upon it all with your own eyes. It's getting late. We should head back to the village. I will talk to the mayor about this matter. Looks like we already got Epona there, and she's carrying bundles of wood for us. It's probably where they, what they were out doing is collecting wood. Makes sense. It's just it's a horse thief taking off with a pony. What the heck? Hey, uh, Link, you there? Yep. Hey, my help me herd the goats. Hey, listen to me lately. Hey, where's Epona? Uh oh. The horse thief took her. Hey. Come on now, hurry up and bring Epona with you. 
Yeah, well, I wanna, the horse thief took her this way. Sneak in here. Being all sneaky, sneaky. Looks like we found him. Washed opponent for you. Well, at least he's not a horse thief. He's taking care of opponent better than Link does. <laughs> One horse really hard, so I thought you deserved a treat. Oh, well, listen, Link. Could you do something for me? Just a piece of grass to play that song for me. You know, the one that opponent likes. Sure. A nice melody. Pona looks happy. Oh, she's all pretty up now, so I suppose you can ride her back. Don't you make her do too much, okay? Sounds good to me. village. Yeah. Uh, should we talk to people? If it is a young link, are you going to close down the ranch for the day? Just close the shop myself. You know all about the mischievous monkeys that have been coming to the village lately. This thing's worrying me a bit. I'll look up tight here. I couldn't stand to have any more goods stolen. Can't trust that good-for-nothing husband to do anything right. Come on, Dad. You can't catch a silly little monkey? Oh, uh, well, no. No, I can't. I'll listen to this Babylon. I didn't mean to keep you. Alright, I'll have to work with you. Now, does she say the same thing? Careful out there. A little bit of frame rate problems, but not much I can do about that, unfortunately. Still play the game, though. Oh, good timing, Link. Something I'd forgotten to tell you. My son Colin is making a fishing rod, so the two of you can play together. You should finish it today, so you can come get it at the house tomorrow. Oh, hi, Link. Making a fishing rod, you know. All I'll have to do is paint it, so get ready for fishing. I want to talk to the mama. Might be easier if I uh, actually get off the horse. What does that say? Oh. How do I just... There we go. There. Evening, Link. 
This is a lovely sunset, isn't it? Not? It's, it's kind of good to spend time with my husband, you know. It gives me time for myself. Uh, do you have to go put the livestock to bed now? Yes, I do. But I don't want to yet. Oh, Link. It looks like you're going to help Fado. Good job. He headed up to the ranch ahead of you. You go finish up your chores before the sun goes down. Alright. Sorry to get you over here in such a hurry, Link. These guys have been awful skittish lately. They won't listen to a word I say. Sorry to ask, bud, but how about you and Epona herd him into the barn real quick? I haven't got much time, so you think you can do it for me? Yeah. Much obliged there, bud. Okay then, go on and herd all these little scamps into the barn for me. guys in. Whoop, whoop. Alright, one last guy. Goat. Done. Link Capona, much obliged to both of y'all. I can cover everything tomorrow without having to trouble you, so just sit back and relax, bud. Oh, but uh, how about today? Want to practice with the fences? Just wait a spell, bud. I'll get them, get them fences set up. Ooh, sorry it took so long. Okay then, y'all ride all you want. Y'all get tired of riding, just jump the gate and head back into the village. Okay, bud? Yeah, yeah. Ain't nothing cooler than fence jumping down, just ride. We're all about approaching the fence, you say dash at the right moment, y'all can jump the middle of the fence. Get tired of yeah, we said that already. I kind of really have to hit it head on in order to jump it properly. Alright, I think we're done for the day. Let's head on out of here. Really? Can we not jump that? dark out already, you know. It's not the best idea to be riding horses at night. I mean, you can, but... Pretty dangerous. You know, that's a good idea. Let's save it. And, uh, that'll be it for this episode, actually. Speed stay frosty, guys. See you later. Bye.